Hi everyone, welcome, uh, welcome to Cambry. This is um, an incredible, beautiful winter's day in Canberra. And Cambry is the traditional name for where we stand. And it was a, a beautiful gift from the Indigenous community to ANU. And it's my pleasure to actually take you inside the construction site. And as you can hear, this place is absolutely abuzz with activity and that's the way I like it. We've got about 550 workers that'll be on site here trying to get this construction home by the end of the year. It's been five years in the making. About 5,000 people gave us advice about what to build. Six new buildings, a car park. And as you can see, the, the activity and the buzz is letting you know that we're just accelerating and we're getting there. There's some things I think that make this project really special. So to my right, over here is the student accommodation. This is brand new beds for students and students are just going to get the best views of Canberra and Black Mountain from this new building, which is pretty phenomenal. The bottom part of it's concrete, the top of it's wood. If I flick through to my left, your right, the new health and wellbeing building is just about to top out. This is a place where there's going to be the new health clinic for students, uh, a new place for people to gather. Counselling are going to live there. And the lovely banging you can hear in the background, the hammering, it's part of the new teaching building, which is just over there. And the first wood panels are just coming out of the ground. And it's like the student accommodation made from glue lamb and CLT. So it's a particularly exciting building because uh, wood has just got a warmth about it. And we want this place to be warm and welcoming to everybody. Kind of behind me here, you can see what will be the lawns here, the main part of Cambry. And down here on the edge of the creek, there'll be a new lunate theatre. People will be able to sit down on the bank of the river to listen and there'll be a ceremonial fire pit for our indigenous community to make sure that this is really the heart of our community here. So at the moment you've got to kind of imagine it but you can begin to see the buildings really popping out of the paper, the designs that we've been talking about for so long. They're really taking shape and they're going up so fast that we thought it was important to capture this moment with you and thank you for everything that you've done to make every single bit of this possible. So just, just over here is the health and well-being, but this is the, the pool here and you can see finally the steel frame going up for the roof and the walls. And as we go further along, you'll be able to see the outline of where the pools are going to be. We've got a mobile crane in here at the moment. It's a bit tricky on site, but we've got three mobile cranes coming in. This one's doing steel work. And as Brett here has explained, the other two cranes are doing the wood panelling for the teaching building and the student accommodation. And I'm just excited because I just saw in the background there concrete boom operating at, at the same time as the, the cranes are operating. It's pretty cool, isn't it? It is. It's extremely cool. So just up behind here is the Culture and Events Building. This is a really significant building. So it's um, polished concrete formwork. And inside that building are going to be the new retractable tier lecture theatres, including lecture theatres that will seat 500 place where you can pull the tiers back on the lectures and you can actually then have events and functions in there. So we think it'll be great not only for teaching, but also a really good place for conferences, for public events and for the community to really come together. So we think it's an exceptional, an exceptional building and, and <laughs> as you can see, things are, are really buzzing along here at the moment. Thank you everybody for joining us on our tour. We hope you stay in touch with the project. We have our website and you can go and check out our updates. But uh, I hope it's giving you a kind of sense of what it's like to be inside the construction site. I know you can't all be here and you'll just watch over the next couple of weeks. This is just going to go up so fast and before you know it, it'll be open and you're all extremely welcome to come and join us in Cambridge.